morning there, tarot lovers. Right, so we've got a couple of cards today, which I've picked before. So both of these, um, I have videos already upon the world reversed and the hermit. Um, I drew the hermit afterwards in order to ask, you know, what, what the world reversed is all about. Because when, when the world is upside down like this, it talks a lot about certain blockages that we might have in order to really experience the fullness of ourselves and these blockages are usually some form of lack of self-worth where we don't feel like we are good enough to manifest everything that we really want so and the hermit is about the guidance that we can find in this journey so what I'd like to do is just do a a very short five minute meditation, see if you can't gain a little bit of clarity on this. Instead of giving you a deeper reading on these cards, let's go into a little meditation. So if you want, press pause on this, find yourself a nice place, just five minute meditation, that's all it's gonna be. See if we can't settle ourselves in a little bit. Make a pause, find a nice space, and when you're ready, we can begin. Okay, so close your eyes and breathe deeply. Bring your attention into your hearts. Deep breaths. Fill your lungs a little bit more than you normally would. Empty your lungs. Empty your lungs more than you normally would as well. Pushing all the air out. Deep breath in. Bring all the air into your body. Fill your lungs and empty your lungs a little bit. This is just to ground yourself. If you're sitting, feel the base of your spine on the surface where you're sitting and root yourself through the base of your spine. If your feet are on the ground and you're sitting in a chair, feel the roots come out of your feet and earth yourself, connecting yourself down. Just feeling strong and connected, grounded. And allow your breath allow your breath to deepen and slow down. And as your breath is slow, bring your attention to your life right now. If there's something that you're not manifesting, if there's something that's not quite with you in your world, something that you really want, something that is, you find over and over again in your life, you have a blockage towards creating. See what this is. Maybe it's an, uh, maybe it's abundance. Maybe it's, maybe it's deep loving connection. Maybe it's just a feeling of satisfaction, a feeling of joy. Whatever it is, identify one thing in your life that is not manifest in the way, from the fullest way that you would like it to be. Breathe deeply. Once you've found that thing, I want you to go inside to yourself and ask yourself one simple question. What belief do I have about myself that blocks me manifesting this that I truly want? See if you can identify a belief about who you are, about life in general. Once you've identified that belief, sit with it and see how it makes you feel. See how it helps you create this lack, this lacking feeling. Breathe deeply into your hearts once again. Notice how this feeling doesn't resonate with your heart. 
Notice how this thought is a false thought. It's not really belonging to you as a soul. It belongs to a program which you picked up somewhere along the line. It relates to an idea that you copied from someone that you were told one time and you chose to believe. It relates to something, a belief that may have helped you in the past but no longer does, is no longer your reality. And connect inside. Take a few deep breaths and we're going to connect to that level of wisdom inside that can come from you if you choose it to. It can come from your higher self, can come from your spirit. Or you can visualize this guidance coming from an inner guide or an outer guide. You're, we all have our guides, we all have higher consciousnesses which are giving us ideas, feeding us inspiration, feeding us guidance continuously. It doesn't matter where this guidance comes from, but it will come through your heart. So breathe into your heart. Bring your attention here and ask yourself, what do I need in order to change this belief, this one belief that I see, that I see holds me back and is an obstacle to my growth and to manifesting what I really want? And sit and listen, be receptive, allow your mind to be open, allow your body to be open. Open up your arms, place your palms facing upwards. Receive. After hearing this message, if it is specific, great. Then it'll come with something that you can specifically do. If it doesn't, if it's a general guidance, ask for one single, single, simple thing that you can do in order to manifest this truth that you desire. Ask for one simple guiding act. What can I do? listen. Mm. And whether this act is something that you can do today or tomorrow or every single day of your life, make a strong resolution to act upon this guidance and to follow through. May this be your guidance for today. I wish you all the best and I hope this has served you in some way.